Welcome back to the NIF tutorial. In this tutorial, we'll try to learn about the visualization block in the workbooks. For that, let's click on the workbooks icon and here we'll create a new workbook by clicking on plus. I would like to add a decal block here. So I'm again clicking on this plus icon and here we'll take stream is equal to authentication where the value of action column is login and the value of status column is failed and the value of user column is not blank. We'll consider the data of a last 10 minutes duration and we'll group this data using user column. Let us just increase this duration to say 15 minutes. Yeah, and this is how the data is represented. Now, if I wish to create a visualization, on this result set, I'll again click on the plus icon and I will select visualization block here. The first thing that we have to add in the visualization block is the name that we wish to provide to that widget. So here I am providing the name as demo login failure. Here you can select the type of the visualization such as bar chart, column chart, radial chart, pie chart and so on. So I'm selecting column chart for now and you can add the columns that you wish to represent in that visualization. So we are selecting user column and we are selecting this count that should be represented in front of that username. So this is basically how the visualization block looks like. It will automatically take the data from the previous block and will create the visuals as per the same. If you want to save this workbook, then you can click on this particular edit icon, provide a name to this workbook. So demo workbook for say visualization, that's the name I have provided. And then you can simply click on the save icon, provide a proper commit message and save this workbook. I hope this explanation will help you to create the visualizations in future seamlessly. Thank you for watching to this tutorial. In the next tutorial, let's try to learn about more exciting concepts about NIF. Thank you.